This is another video for July 14th, 2021. This one is on keeping the Sabbath. Now, the Sabbath was given again for Israel to keep and uh, not to the church. It was um, uh, taken by some churches and especially well-known church like the Seventh-day Adventists and uh, promoted that uh, Christians should be keeping the Sabbath. Well, let's take a look at what the Bible says. In Exodus chapter 31, verse 14, God speaking again says, Ye shall keep the Sabbath, therefore. But who's he talking to? He's talking to Israel. For it is holy unto you. I'm going to skip the last part and then go to verse 17. It is a sign between me and the children of Israel forever. It's not a sign between God and the church. It's a sign between God and Israel. But if Christians want to keep the Sabbath, they should keep it as it's written. So let's go back to the last part of verse 14 where it says, in the first part it says, You shall keep the Sabbath, therefore, for it is holy unto you. Now the last part, this is what Christians don't seem to know about or want to follow. Everyone that defileth it, or doesn't keep the Sabbath, or works on the Sabbath, everyone that defileth it shall surely be put to death. Now that was a strong thing, and they did that in Israel. Person caught working on the Sabbath, they were put to death. They were stoned to death. But for the Seventh Day Adventist Church, uh, people that are members of that church that are caught working on the Sabbath, I don't think any of them are put to death. Uh, so let's keep in mind what the Scriptures rightly teach, and let's study to show thyself approved, rightly dividing the word of truth, as Second Timothy two fifteen says.